In this video, we are going to see how to enter a pipe in the model and how to add load cases. In this scenario, we'll add two different load cases. One is the design case, the temperature is 120 degrees C and the pressure is 5 megapascals. The second case is temperature of 95 degrees centigrade and pressure of 3.75 megapascals. So let's have a look at how to do that. First, let's enter the pipe. To start entering pipe, we need to click on this button here, Insert Pipe. When we click on it, Start Prop asks what should be the starting number and end number. Generally, you do not need to worry much about the node numbers. Just click on OK and it will present you with the different types of information you need to add for piping geometry. Here, we need to add a pipe length. Be careful that the dimensions of length are in meters, whereas the dimensions of pipe diameter are in millimeters. We can change this in the settings and we'll see that in the next video. First, let's add piping geometry. So, the pipe length starts at a pump and it goes in x direction 1 meter. The outer diameter of the pipe is 323.85 millimeters and the wall thickness is 10.3124 millimeters. Mill tolerance is 12.5 which is standard. Corrosion allowance is 1.5 millimeters. The material of the pipe is A53 grade 2 and the pipe is seamless. Currently, it only shows one pressure and temperature load case. We'll see how to add different load cases very shortly. Initially, let's just add the operating load case. So the pressure or the load case number one pressure is 5 megapascals and temperature is 120 degrees Celsius. The test pressure is 1.5 times 5 which is 7.5 megapascals. We do not have any insulation, so we don't need to worry about the insulation density. Um, the fluid density is 1200 kilograms per cubic meter. We'll add that here. Start Prop automatically calculates the weight of the fluid. It has also calculated the weight of pipe here. There are additional parameters that can be added if the well quality factor is different, if it's a high pressure pipe and all of the different information here. Right now we'll just worry about this one. Click on apply and start prop will show you the pipe that has already been generated. Next this pipe goes vertically up 5 meters. So we'll just add 5 meters in Z direction. All of the other parameters remain the same and we'll just hit apply. Next pipe goes in the y direction 2.5 meters. So we'll click OK and it goes in y direction 2.5 meters. We'll again click apply and next the last bit is pipe goes 5 meters in x direction. So we'll click OK and 5 meters in x direction. We'll hit OK here. This is how the geometry of the pipe looks like. At node number 1, pipe is connected to a pump. At node number 5, pipe is connected to a vessel, which we'll model in the next subsequent videos. Let's have a look at how to add the second load case. Go to File, Operating Mode Editor, the first operating mode is the, the design pressure and temperature load case where the temperature was 120 degrees Celsius and pressure was 5 megapascals. We want to add one more operating case. So we'll click on add and main operating mode. This will add another mode and this is operating pressure and temperature case. It is the mode type is sustain. If it was an occasional load case, you could have changed it here. But as it is sustained, we'll leave it. 
just say OK here. Now, let's select all pie. We did it by hitting Control plus A. We could have also done that by clicking on Edit, Select All. Next, let's change the temperature and pressure or the case, load case from Design PT to Operating PT. And as we change it, we can see that for all of those pipes, the pressure is zero, temperature is zero. So we need to do something here. So what we'll do is we'll add the pressure as 3.75 megapascals and we'll change the temperature to 95 degrees C. Once we have done this change, you can see that the pressure and temperature has changed here for the operating load case. Next, what we need to do is we need to change the fluid density from 0 to 1200 kg per meter cube. That which was set uh, for the design temperature and pressure. So this is how you add a piping geometry to the model and you add the design pressure and operating pressure and temperature so different mode cases different load cases to the model